Who's that? Just a friend. You miss her? Yeah. It's all my cousin the dad thing. Is your cousin? Yeah. Josephine's your cousin? Yeah. Yeah. Mama, see my. Yes, Brayden. Brayden over there. Brayden is over there? Yeah. I didn't see him. Oh, there. I don't know if it. How about kisses? Can I have kisses? Kiss for daddy? Nope. <laughs> Hi guys, good afternoon. So I'm here at the park with my daughter. Uh, beautiful Saturday afternoon in New England. <clears throat> my mom's over there at the park with her. I'm gonna join them in a few minutes. So I thought I'd make a quick video here and um, I guess you know Lynn made a video and she kind of let the cat out of the bag <clears throat> that I'm coming back to the Philippines and we had a lot of comments and um, yes that's true I'm on my way back but not yet um, I have to get a lot of requirements um, I have to have to I actually have to get a visa on stamped on my passport before I come back. Um, <clears throat> so that's gonna take some time. Uh, everything, so I wanted to talk about that process. So um, everything, so I had to get all my requirements and I'm not gonna go over the list because it's, it's pretty extensive. Um, <clears throat> but I need two things from Lynn in the Philippines and I need one, a barangay certificate um, which basically is a certificate proving that she, where she resides in the Philippines. Uh, number two, I need an affidavit, which is, which is like an invitation to invite me back to the Philippines. Um, <clears throat> so I need those two things from Lynn. And once I have those two things, along with all my other requirements, <clears throat> I have to submit them. Uh, online via email to the consular's office in New York. Um, and once they get it, they're going to review it and make sure I have all my paperwork is in order. And then they said they're going to send it to the DFA for a stamp of approval. And then they're going to notify me that it's all approved. Then I have to mail everything to the consular's office in New York. So it's a kind of a process. And I don't know, whenever you deal with emails with the consular's office, it's not good. It's not good news because it takes a long time. Um, so I don't know how long that's going to take. So my guess is that, you know, I don't know when I'll be back. Uh, it could be before Christmas. Uh, most likely it's going to be sometime after Christmas. Um, getting all my... Um, Aaron's done here. It's nice to be home. It's nice to be back uh, in the United States. And um, so I hope that clears everything up for everybody. And we're having a good time here. I do miss the Philippines. I miss Lynn. I know the baby misses her. And um, thanks to all the support, all the comments, the new, the new viewers, the old viewers. Uh, you guys are great. We love you. And um, we'll see you on the next video. Thanks for watching. I think it's first time in the car wash. Are you in the car wash? No. Oh, you scared? No? No, don't open the window. <laughs>
Don't open the window. So we're in the couch. Look at the sap. Look at this. Oh my god. It's a monster coming to get us. Look at it. It's an octopus. Oh, he's getting the car. Oh my god. It's a car wash, not an octopus. I think it's an octopus coming to get us. Yeah. Oh my god. It's a door. Maybe like a door. Wow. Oh my god. To the car wash, huh? Yeah, it's so pretty. So pretty? Did you like that? Yeah. Wow. Get my new 